Hello everyone, I'm Ryan Chan, the CEO and founder of Upkeep. In today's video, we'll be delving into the captivating world of turnaround maintenance procedures. Specifically, we'll break down the five crucial phases that dictate success in this field. If you're part of a maintenance or operations team, this is a must-watch for you. Stay tuned as we'll be revealing how a well-planned turnaround ensures efficient use of time and enhances your plant's safety, efficiency, and overall performance. Let's dive into the fascinating world of turnaround maintenance procedures. A turnaround is when one or more assets are temporarily taken out of service so maintenance tasks can be performed. While the specifics may vary across different plants and industries, there are five main phases that are typically observed. These are definition and scoping, preparation, execution, startup and turnover, and evaluation. So let's kick things off with the first phase, definition and scoping. In this phase, maintenance teams create a list of activities that will be performed on the assets. These activities could range from performance tests and component replacements to repairs or standby. The result of this phase is a detailed work list of the exact activities to be performed on specific assets. To keep track of this work list, a Computerized Maintenance Management System, or CMMS, is your best friend. Moving on to the second phase, we have preparation. With the work list in hand, the team can identify the resources they'll need to cover the scheduled activities. This includes material resources, as well as the knowledge and training needed for staff to perform all tasks. Staffing requirements are also crucial. Tasks can be assigned to either internal or external personnel, depending on management's decision. And let's not forget about safety. This phase also accounts for safety requirements and procedures that need to be checked to reduce risks and avoid unexpected incidents. Next up is the execution phase. This phase kicks off with the stoppage of the equipment. Most tasks in this phase involve some form of inspection, corrective action, and testing. As tasks are completed, they're updated and removed from the work list. And guess what? The progress of this phase can be effectively tracked using a computerized maintenance management system. The fourth phase is startup or turnover. This phase is an extension of the execution phase and the transition back to normal operations. Once all tasks in the work list have been performed and the final tests passed, the startup can begin. This phase involves closely monitoring the operational state. When satisfactory conditions are met during the startup, the ramp-up can begin, gradually bringing the facility back to normal running conditions. It's a crucial period that minimizes the risk of any incidents. Finally, we reach the evaluation phase. This phase reconciles all tasks that have been performed. It accounts for all costs incurred from the turnaround process and confirms that all work orders and purchase orders have been closed. Any leftover material stock can then be credited back for future use. An audit is usually conducted at this phase to assess the state of each asset. Any actions identified from the turnaround procedure are listed and delegated to the accountable units within the team. The final collection of data and observations provides insights on the plant's safety, efficiency, performance metrics, and overall performance. So there you have it, the five main phases of a turnaround maintenance procedure. Remember, a well-planned turnaround ensures that time lost is spent efficiently. So plan well, execute effectively, and evaluate thoroughly. Thank you for watching this video. We've covered the five crucial phases of a turnaround maintenance procedure, definition and scoping, preparation, execution, startup and turnover, and evaluation. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. For more information and resources, visit our website at upkeep.com. Your support helps us create more content like this. Until next time, keep planning, executing, and evaluating.